Good afternoon, church. I am Javier Canty from the Mount Welcome Missionary Baptist Church, where Dr. Darren Roberts is the pastor. In times of trouble, trouble, is there such a thing? Well, this is a word I choose to not use in my vocabulary because it is only a disguise that comes in the forms of obstacles, trials, tribulations, and worries, just to name a few. I prefer to believe in peace and life. For God says in John chapter 14, verse 27, peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither afraid. In life, we have ups and downs, but what matters is how we deal with the situation. Do you give up or keep your head up? Do you stay strong and believe or do you underachieve? Why not choose to use the guidance of God's word in Psalms chapter 16, verse 8? I have set the Lord always before me, while he is at my right hand, and I will not be shaken. Being raised by a very intelligent, wise, and smart woman, she always reminds me that everything happens for a reason. We may not understand at the time, but God does have a plan. And no matter what the situation may be, we have to man up and accept it. I'm pretty sure we all have stories to share, but are we proud of how we dealt with that situation? It's cool to hear about what you're going through, but most importantly, it's all about your response and your reaction. As Ephraim mentioned, I have set the Lord always before me while he is at my right hand and I will not be shaken. In times of trouble, I know things may be very hard, but you have to open your eyes and realize that you are not alone. God is there on your right side because he is always right and not on your left because he has never left you and he never will. Statistically speaking, black teens have already been labeled as failures. They state that the average 17-year-old average black male will not graduate from high school, will become a teen parent, and will not add on to college population, but instead prison populations. It is possible, a strong possibility, that any one of us could be another Trayvon Martin, another young 17-year-old black male who lost his life for no reason at all. Shaking my head, we will forever live in times of trouble. But may I inform you that there are a few of us trying to reverse those stats, like me and my brother Simeon over here. Let me give you a prime example. I am 17 years old. I am an African-American. I am graduating at the Georgia Dome, May 19th at 2 o'clock. I am the first teenage man of the year for the Atlanta Missionary Baptist Association. I will be attending Ron Hart University on a partial basketball scholarship. All right. I am an Eagle Scout. I am enlisted in the National Guard and will be serving my country. Right. And, and last but not least, I am a child of God. Yeah. Being young and a strong warrior for Christ, I refuse to be shaken. Just imagine if Jesus was shaken by his peers, there's no telling what life would be like today. So when trouble comes your way, stay strong, stand firm, and keep your head held high. Thank yeah. you.